Welcome to my channel IT Smart Training. In the previous video, uh, I had shown you the configuration or the creation of the email address policy from GUI mode. So now I will show you the same thing as uh, in the uh, CUI mode. Okay. So if I check that this policy, which is which was created by GUI mode, if I choose this email address format. Here I show you these are the default templates and we used this default template to configure our recipients. So if I go to the more option we can use the more specific information to create an email address. So there are some parameters are used to create a more uh, specific email address. So that should be created uh, in GUI mode as well as it will create it from CUI mode also. So in the CUI mode we have to create the exchange control panel. Uh, no need to exchange control panel. We have to configure it from exchange PowerShell. So in the exchange 2019 there is an option exchange, ma exchange management shell. Just click on it and it will show you the exchange management shell. It will take a few seconds to open. So there are certain parameters to use the more specific informations to create an email address. These are the parameters. If I use percentage G at the rate uh, smartlab.com, it will take the first name of the email address. For example, first name is IT middle name is smart middle name is smart and the last name is training okay and the alias is IT smart okay and the display name IT smart training okay if I use the first option percentage G at the rate smartlab.com then it will take what G means the first name it will take the first name my first name is IT that means it will take IT at the rate smartlab.com okay if I choose percentage I at the rate smartlab.com so it will take the middle name middle name is smart smart at the rate smartlab.com if I select percentage S at the rate smartlab.com then it will take the last name last name is training if I choose percentage D, D means display name, it will take IT smart training at the rate of smartlab.com. If I choose percentage M at the rate smartlab.com, it will check the exchange alias. Alias name is IT smart, so it will take IT smart at the rate of smartlab.com. So if we configure more specific to this, like suppose I choose percentage x means a value a value you can choose i can j i just check the value value is 2 s s means here is showing the surname at the rate smartlab.com so wh what will be configured here the 
uses the x letter is a surname means if I use instead of x we can configure if I uh, configure the instead of x is 2 x is the value is 2 x value is 2 the first two letters of the surname are used means my in the as per my notepad s means surname my surname or the last name last name is training so two letter tr at the rate smartlab.com okay so if i choose g g means the given name or the first name x value is 2 if i x value is suppose here the x value is uh, 1 okay 1 g i configured here 1 g that means it will take the first letter first letter of the first name is i i at the rate smartlab.com okay so this is how we can modify our uh, recipients more with the more specific information so now I show you to create uh, some uh, users policy with some more specific configuration okay so at first I just create one thing I create two users over here suppose I create a mailbox mailbox user here I configure a alias alias is suppose um, alias is um, user 1 ok this is a new user first name is user last name is uh, IT display name is whatever you want login name is u1 no user 1 provide a password okay so I saved it and this user account is created so now I just go to the domain controller once I just check uh, this uh, domain is created uh, sorry this user is also created in domain controller you can check that this one so I just set the address state or province here Kolkata okay I just select state or province Kolkata done now I go to the exchange server here I have to provide the command so a command template is uh, written over here this is the command I just copy it and I need to change something I just no open a notepad in exchange server and paste it over here as first we have to create new email address policy the command is new hyphen email address policy hyphen name the email address policy name is custom email address pol include recipient mailbox user this uh, policy is apply on the user who have the mailbox 
and then condition is it's filtered the state or province if it select the state or province Kolkata we can choose the multiple state or province I select only Kolkata suppose I have a hundred user some users are from Kolkata some users are from Bangalore some users are from Chennai so I just want to apply this uh, policy for the Kolkata users only so I just choose uh, state of province Kolkata then enable email address template and the template will be SMTP colon I just choose my first name is what my first name is user I just choose first two letter of the user that is US so what will be the parameter first 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 name is denoted by G that means I need a two first two letter of the first name so that is percentage 2 G so I need to provide here percentage 2 G and I need the surname the full surname so in the, here the full surname or the last name is IT so I just mention here surname is percentage S so percentage S so that means it will take first two letter of the first name and the last name okay so you have to put percentage percentage 2g percentage s at the rate of smartlab.com this is the hold command I just copy it and paste it inside the exchange cell and enter see this policy is created custom email address policy so if I check that which email address policy is created so I have to provide this command get hyphen email address policy go to the exchange server get email address policy so I have three email address policy one is a default policy another one is new policy next one is custom email address policy next I have to update the email address policy means need to apply enter it's updated so if I go to the panel something is opened if I go, go to the panel and go to the mail flow we can see that uh, another user address policy has been created and the parameter is like this you can see also the parameter parameter is like this and if I go to the recipients here is a problem because this is taken I just remove this policy refresh once 
go to recipients and refresh check us it first two letter then it at the smartlab.com okay so this is how we can manipulate the exchange user email address and this same thing will be configured the over here if I open this policy and go to if I go to the format you can check see I configured it from command which is taken here also okay so this is how we can create a custom email address policy from exchange powershell thank you thank you for watching